Welcome. Thank you so much for tuning in here from Cantrips. That is me, Stella Babbler. That is me on this evolutionary, revolutionary ride that is happening at this time. I am really going to attempt to make this a short one, guys. Um, but I also want to remind you that there will be a purple card video coming soon um, that came from the divine tip of topics, right? That we have that if you check out my last purple card video, I introduced this purple card video that is coming soon. Um, it's what false narrative belief shortcoming fuck up about yourself do you need to address and transmute the fuck out of right now. Okay, so that one's coming soon. You know, bear with me, but I do have a little few announcements to be made um, in regards to um, a lot of things. <laughs> okay, so the first announcement is to influence me to be um, round three, drawing to an end. Um, and I will learn soon enough if I made it into round four. After round four, it, it, it is then semifinals and then finals. Right, so it's like really the heat is on. Check up. I don't know the word. <laughs> the heat is on. The heat is on. It is so on. Okay, it is so motherfucking on. So today I announced on my Instagram, I went live at Enchantress, E N C H A N T R E S S. I'll share the link to that live where I announced. Two winners to the hand and foot Venetian rich oil it is so amazingly like wonderful, especially if you are in the part of the world that has seasons change. Seasons change. It's time to look outside you. Yeah, it seems like not to be. Anyways, that's just my age, right? <laughs> but either way, um, amazing. Off, right? It is absolutely delicious. It's for your hands and feet. You can use it on you. So sweet affirmation card will be with this. You know what I mean? But you can also use it on a divine lover. You can use it there too. No? I know I could be all celibate, you see, but think even me oh naturally, girly, what you think? <laughs> Which reminds me, people keep asking me about um, the sexual tarot. They want to see more sexual tarot readings. <laughs> Go figure! <laughs> Coming soon to the theater near you. Uh, YouTube, and can't just do that word on YouTube, right? So um, I'm excited. So I announced the two winners um, of these wonderful things. One of them is actually even shipping out to the UK. <laughs> okay. The UK because I get a lot of UK love out there and so I'm so thankful for my UK ears. <laughs> um in any kind of way because y'all yeah, be some joyful love beings, okay? Uh huh, yeah. Yeah. It's like we love you. I love you. We love you. I love you. <laughs> So cheers and another one they believe is Queens, um, New York, you know. So hey, New York and get out of town. So um yeah, amazing. So I'm excited to ship these out, which they which they already know um is gonna go out on my next shipment of orders that I am coming to. And so that would be between this week or next the following like you know anyways most times even if things are whatever it's three to nine business days <laughs> when you go to which utopian.com because life and alchemy you know um i be a busy alchemist you know what i mean so and a lot of my um like especially like explosive baths and things like that like that it takes a lot of work and preparation and i have a lot of those that um have to ship out and stuff like that too and the prep work for each one and the process is it's a lot of work and so you know and you know also I do a lot of physical things, you know what I mean? So, you know, between you know, the traveling and things like that and, you know, teaching and coaching and all events and the sessions that I have, you know, with person, you know, on phone or Zoom. These things that I make and the things that I do, these things that I make, these things that I do require me. <laughs> you know what I mean? So I'm um, excited, you know, things. So 
This influenced me to the opportunity. I cannot overly emphasize enough how important this is for um, this opportunity is and how um, amazing sauce it can truly be of an opportunity for someone like me. And so I'm just so thankful for those that have uh, voted. Um, first vote is free. So if you read and you receive and you um, like my energy and use my energy and it benefits you in some kind of way and just feeling good, like I'm an energy activator healer. Anyways, just being in my energy feels good. It feels good. And even if it triggers you, that's for your own wonderful evolution. It's a revolution, darling. Won't happen one way or another. Here again. And so um yeah. And um, so that there's the two winners. Um oh Cisco Kaz. Don't do that. Andromeda. Let's see. But cats don't know gay. <laughs> but dogs do. Unless <laughs> they're big dogs when they can jump over a gate too. But not my little mopies. Okay. <laughs> I try to do a barricade and I try to different angle just because for different reasons to bring something over there. You know, whatever the case may be and working on a lot of things. So, um, yeah, so there's a lot of busy, 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 busy. So, all right, so you can go check that out over there. I'm going to be sharing a master link. That master link links us in every single magical, wonderful, abundant feeling way. Um, you know what I'm saying? Um, that's so that's to be. Go to witchyutopian.com um, at Enchantress, E N C H A N T O E S S on Instagram. And also Witchy Utopian, W I T C H Y U T O. T I A N on TikTok. Thank you. Oh, and Enchantress Viva, we're here on YouTube Land and on Spotify and Anchor. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, the topic of this mini tarot video is it's this new week, your upcoming new week. So whenever you find these little girls, these messages are timeless in a very dynamic, beautiful way that is like just transformational for you and energetically therapeutic and healing. It just feels also good and right that you align so bright and you just unify even more so because you eat the fucking mana, eat the fucking mana, eat the fucking mana, right? And it just feels so good. And you just eat the fucking mana, you know what I'm saying? And whatever is gonna transcend them, but there's a lot of energies that are gonna come in here at this moment in time until we activate from our highest of the divine that is ignited within our own shrine. So I I am present at this time, right? So this new week, what new week starting at us? Okay. A lot of shit happens within minutes. <laughs> So what new week starting advice do we have for you beautiful souls that are here at the time? But this week, what's going down? And we're starting off with the under the sea. Under the sea. Under the sea. So a lot of activating, a lot of moving. Ooh, three of pentacles. Here we are. Okay. So a lot of work. A lot of work. Right? You're starting to see the fruits of something. You're starting to see the fruits of something that you're building because you've got the nine of pentacles here. You're starting to see the fruits of something that you're building, that you're working on. And you're starting, and it could even be in an attitude. It could be a mindset. It can be emotional layers of something. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 12, and three. Going back to the three, 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 six, nine, right? So you've got something cultivating here for you at this time. I'm looking at her face, and when she's looking up at the two of pentacles, she says, "Yes." So it reminds me of gratitude. So no matter the challenge, and no matter the position, and no matter the experience. 
there's a reminder here of being in a state of absolute gratitude and appreciation for that which is cultivating. You're creating something that's tangible here because you are the magician. So there's something here landing, right? This is great. <laughs> Ta-ta! It's right on! So it's like, yeah, it's like, there's something here. There's, there's wish fulfillment. There's, there's cultivation. There's culmination. There's, there's activation, right? There's getting out, right? So the eight of swords is here. So it's highlighted. So, right, so if it's not happening, it's getting out of your own way, right? So that all of this can happen. Right, so any kind of oh, so he was the advice. Okay, 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 go for fall. This is gonna be a uh, pretty delicious, <laughs> nutritious creation for you, serving your evolution at this moment in time. Or perceptional, right? You can choose the reality of the you can choose perception so that way you can activate the energy of energy that is needed for you to thrive, strive, and that. Right? So this is a mixed crowd. This could even be in regards to love. This could be in regards to your career. This could be in regards to your passion, your, your goals, your hobbies, your, your vision, what you want to do, right? Um, it could also be in love too, because I'm getting that very long too, right? It's completely in love and experience or, or building up, building yourself up for that kind of ultimate kind of experience, getting out of your own way, right? So you're getting out of your own way, getting out of your own way in terms of disappointment, in whatever field of category of disappointment. That is the end. right? So that's the uh, starting advice for this week. You got a lot of shit to be grateful for, okay? And if you can't see past your circumstance, right? And you can't see the magnificent blessing, bless up, um, and building my, you know, pentacles. You gotta remember this about pentacles. You know, people can see the pentacles. You see the pentacles, you want the pentacles. And pentacles makes us feel so secure, right? Because the, 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 the thing about pentacles, energy, okay? Understanding this in the tarot community, right? Like in ancient tarot land, it's the final suit before the, before, it's the final suit of the four suits, right? I'm just trying to simplify it. This is a big quick one, it's not a tarot, tarot tutorial, okay? Although, when you are interested in tarot tutorials, I'm going to be starting a class <laughs> on witchingutopian.com because I have been asked far too many times already to, to ignore it anymore. You know what I mean? Um, because I really do, I, 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 you know, just a little bit of history too about my um, tie to tarot and astrology. I have been reading cards for over 35 years. I don't know life without being able to commune with Carol and all of it. At the age of five, as young as five, I studied cardamancy. And by the age of nine, I already had my first Carol deck. And so, um, yeah, like I've been for 35 plus years reading and I enjoy intuitively reading and interpreting and understanding the dynamics of the tarot. So um, if you would be interested in um, learning more with me, like it's not gonna be anything expensive or ridiculous, you know what I mean? It's just a it's a, a fee and investment that you would make if that was something that you would want to do. You know what I'm saying? Um, and you know like we'll figure it out. Like I have I don't got the logistics of how I'm gonna how I see myself doing it yet. I just keep getting the prompting. So if you want to be staying uh, in tune and up to date with everything that we do, you can just subscribe for free at witchyutopian.com and stay up to date with all the things that we've got going and 
the moment that um, I share the class thing up there, you can sign up over there. You know what I mean? So, um, yeah. So, whatever. Um, so, right? So, you're starting new week, starting. <sighs> One second, guys. I don't think you have all my Andromeda in videos. I don't like this. Okay. Okay, that's Andromeda, okay? You want to go in there? Come on, hold on. Andromeda. Ready? Come on. Come on. Okay, so, it's Andromeda. Shiva and her are twins. <laughs> so, um, anyway, right, so, thank you. <laughs> I can't share now. No. <laughs> okay. We, okay, we're here. New week, starting week. You have so much going on for you. And then we're also in like Aries energies too. So a lot of things can get heated quickly. And so don't lose sight. Don't lose sight of all that you have here, right? It might not, it might be three. Right? It might be free, but it's to be grateful for that. You know what I mean? Because what you're building is more. Right? So the thing about pentacles is what I was saying is that it's the last suit. So it is the one that takes the longest to cultivate here in the 3D. And it's the only suit here tied to 3D. Because you have cups. That's tied to our emotions. That ain't 3D. Right? You have sword. That's tied to the mental. That ain't 3D. Okay. <laughs> so you've got, you got one. Right? That's like passion, creativity, like fuel, spirit, right? That ain't tied to the 3D. The only one that's tied to the 3D is the manifesting pentacle. Do you understand that? So it requires your inner standing of patience while you cultivate that, which might seem not like much, but this little is And it's your attitude where it's checking you. Don't be like this when you should be like this. And I know you can't see it because of the lighting. So let me turn off the lighting. You see the face? Say like this. <laughs> No, it's just it's too dark in here and I'm not tired. <laughs> like just sleepy. Okay. So yeah, oh and then look at her face over here. It's like ungrateful. Mm. It's easy to miss our lack of gratitude when we think we are doing so many right things. <laughs> what is that? Sister, it's easy to miss your lack of motherfucking gratitude for things that you got going when you think you are high, high and mighty for your good deeds, good attitude, revolution, you know what I mean, and what you're about and what you're caring about, you know what I mean, but then still complain and be upset and, 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 and comparing and contrasting certain kind of things because 
you're looking at certain things. So like even in terms of the eight of swords, so it's in your mind, right? I think that might be too like I your grasp. Because look at even in this this depiction, the pentacles are over her head. So that which you seek or want that you've been working on might seem over your head, beyond your control. But here you are coming into your nine of pentacles. This is this is cultivated. This is this is success. This is achievement. This is this is this is a buildup of that which was over your head. And that shit might take time, like three, six, nine, three, six, nine, three weeks, three days, three months, three years, nine, nine months, pregnancy to a birth of something, a gestation period. Like, and look at you now, she's starting to touch it. Look, she's only touching one at this time. So it's like, a glimpse into that which is amazing here. But it's four. So in regards to building your foundation into something more, you need to get out of your own head. You need to get out of your own way, right? You need to see the value in your own magicianary ways and skills and ways of being that are here for you because you have a lot of things building too and I don't want to ignore right I don't want to ignore this king of cups that's right here right so so there is okay and then as I'm looking at it I'm looking at the king of cups energy looking at the nine of pentacles energy so this too so this upcoming week might be a love opportunity, something new that you're being offered to by someone that sees you. It's all true. Right? So the attitude that you should start your new week off on is one in gratitude. Despite how things might appear on the outside external, because you've been doing so much work on stuff and the value of you has gone the fudge up because you are working on you. You are doing the things that you need to do. And so don't get so caught up in any kind of trappings and ways of thinking that don't deserve my now for you. Because right now for you is a powerful time because you are the fucking magician. There is a wish being granted. There is some saving grace here. There is love. There is opportunity. There is growth here. There is something popping up for you that it might even come out of the blue. But mm -mm, it's not out of the blue. This is cultivated. Nine, ten, twelve, twelve, three. 3. Because of the Holy Trinity like within you so deep. And there's just something here. So, so yeah. So go into your week and create that feeling, feeling extra gratitude, right? Because look at she's holding two. Now, two. And the water. It's like, because she's in the water. I'm looking at it, mermaid land. She's still in a mermaid. And she's picking two pentacles, right? But she got two pentacles, two earthly pentacles in her hand, even while she's still in the water. So there might be in this new week, this new opportunity, something that you're holding on that you feel passionate about, that you're holding on to. So it could be an idea, it could be, um, hold on. So, right, so here, something is more tangible now that may have been not so tangible or appearing tangible to you before. You know, and so now here you are. Here you are. Like shit just got real. There is light here. News too. Something beyond. Two, two. 
two, 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 four, four, right? With change, because I looked at five right after. So there's change happening here. There's an opportunity here, right? Look at coming out clear. So we're activating our throat chakra with our crown, sacral B homebound, rooted in our truth, tangible, holding on to that which was maybe not tangible before, and finding peace after and balance after. And, and maybe this is a love story here too, or maybe even just a personal love story, a personal journey like that, which is here for you to balance out things for you, right? Um, look at six of cups too. There's magic here for you. Something coming true. Something, something, something that you held on to, that you worked on. And, and, and if you're not there yet, understand that you're in the energy of being that last relationship confirmation, affirmation for you to know that it's, it's coming. So don't lose sight of that which is coming, even if you're in a storm, even if you're in, you haven't seen it yet, even if you haven't touched the principle yet, it's here for you and it's your attitude that's going to determine for you to speed. of your place in this world. Bottom of the deck, eight of something. You can have the cup in the water and here on earth and have this outpouring of this potential. This is, this is, this is, this is the birthing of a whole new world. A whole new The universe has my back. We're going to end it with that. So here we go. Let's just throw the light here. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> Lights on. Light camera option. Here we go. All right. So the universe has your back. Know this. This is fact. And you're just going to repeat these affirmations right back. Quote to yourself in the middle. Quote to yourself right now. Affirm. Confirm. Be so proud. Right? Right? So here we go. The universe has your back. Yeah. The universe works fast and I'm having fun. So have fun. The universe works fast and I'm having fun. So have fun. Like so you're starting advice for this week and all the energy is to stay in a state of gratitude. You know what I mean? Because you're working and you're cultivating and you're making something any scope and something you're creating something. So don't fudge it up with your badass and then get attitude or lower vibrational ways of thinking, get out of your own way. So you're such your own unique off in this kind of way that's an upliftment is what you got to say so you use your universal tools that you have that you can activate within you and every single way that you do and here it is what what's a way a way that i can channel activate get into this activation of transmutation transformation i'm going to activate my joy meter what makes me joyful and if you don't know what that is then you need to get in for your win to know what makes me joyful because i can depend on no more folks to bring that to me here so let me be the joy factor for my life here, for real, because I am in, I'm responsible and accountable for the energy, energy that I bring to every motherfucking table. Say, right? Like the moment I realign with love, clear direction is presented to me, right? What would love do? I would love respond. How would a person like myself be? activated to act in love for myself for me in defense of me in, uh, in, 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 in absolute close divinity for myself that um how how what does this look like right so right you're newly starting a vice right 
be more loving towards yourself, be more compassionate towards your own condition, right? And remind yourself who the fudge you are and how much you have worked on that has been over your head and your head. I can taste it. I can feel it. I believe, right? The presence of love will always cast out fear. Right? Beautiful. I love this. Okay. I am a spirit having a human experience and I'm moving it closer to love. Right? So activating this movie study advice is to activate the attitude of gratitude and love for you in your own condition at this time as you continue to prosper and align. Right? When I lean on certain human things, I change my mind about the world I see. Okay? Beautiful. With the prayer and meditation, I create a ripple effect of peace in the world. Joy is the ultimate creator. And I'm just going to end that there because we started off with that being the first part to hear. So I just want to thank you all for that. If this is um, something that you enjoy, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Um, there's nothing here and all this kind of stuff. I will eventually update with my friends too, but I got to go and everything. And I got to move. Um, either way, Thank you so much. Um, so next time. So yeah, also remember the next topic of the next pick a card is um, what false narrative, belief, shortcoming. Fuck up about yourself. Do you need to address so we can transmute that bit, that bit, okay? And transmute the fuck out of right now, okay? So love and divine alchemy to you. Thank you so much. I hope you um, enjoy your upcoming new week. This is your new week starting advice for whenever you receive these messages at the time. These are um, timeless messages here for you to receive and keep it up the bottom whenever.